day-to-day -day teaching and learning in prefabricated buildings is completely unsuitable for any child and for any teacher. Um, the lack of space, obviously, the lack of proper heating in the winter and then overheating in the summer. Um, you know, we were trying to do sensory rooms and we're trying to do, you know, trying to, to give the very best educational experience that we can to the children of the school. And it's extremely difficult when you're in cramped, cramped conditions. I think it's OK, but as you can see, the library is conjoined with a smaller classroom and we need more space. And since the hall is crossroad, it's not our own, so it doesn't really help. It'd be very much better if they did have a bigger school because there'd be a lot more benefits to a bigger school instead of, like, in a little classroom that can be like a bit chilly in winter sometimes. Sometimes the radiators do break and like the water shuts off sometimes.